Hello and welcome back to another video. My name is Dark Wolf Art and today we're going to be looking at some classic toys from the late 80s, 90s. We are going to be looking at my collection of mask toys. So um, we're going to have a look at this one first because I'm not quite <laughs> sure how to transform this one. I know this is supposed to come go up but uh, I have no idea how. Um, I'd put this back together again. I mean, these have all come out of the attic after being played for for many years back in my childhood, but I have still have no idea how this one pops up. So, uh, yep, we have this truck thing. By the way, I don't know any of the names. So it's all gonna be this and that. <laughs> the next one we're gonna be looking at is this little guy here in this car. And this one's a nice, easy transformation. We just pull. And it all flips out, things go up, that comes up there, and you've got yourself a little tank. And also in the back, he has a uh, claw which comes out. There we go. So we grab onto people. Put back in there. Put those down. Close this back up. Come on, that's it. Then. We'll click inside, and he's back to be in a car again. Click. Come on, click. There we go. Whee. Grab the next one out of the box, and uh, the wheels will come off. But they're supposed to come off the wheels. Come on. Which is this little purple... Volkswagen Beetle thing, which uh, if you lift this up, the wheels come off like this. Come on, and they connect together. So you got a little motorbike there, which comes apart really easily. They've never clicked together. Yeah. And then we got the main shout, which if we click down on top it, flips up, and there's a little jetpack with some missing bullets. I think they're in the box somewhere, but. Not 100% sure. No. You know, with most of these things, like they're going to be like flying vehicles rather than anything else. It seems that mask likes to really fly. So there you go. There's the uh, purple Volkswagen. Wee. Off it goes. Next up is one of my uh, favourite vehicles from the mask collection, which is Indy Racing Car. Where the doors fall off because the clips broke, so the door can go over there. So the way this one transforms, if we click a little button on top. Come on. It all springs open. Goes up like this. These doors are supposed to come down, I believe. Yeah. So they've got little guns on the side. Obviously. This one doesn't anymore. And it also has a bullet at the front, which I don't have any more, or might have, don't know. Let's just click on that. Put that back down, and uh, try and put you on the side. There we go. Shoom. Next up, one of the most boring ones. Uh, this little motorbike that we got here. Stand up, there we go. With the uh, hook on the back being uh, broken, it doesn't reel in anymore. Uh, but yeah, this is boring because all it does is this. So yeah, it either flies or it goes across water. Like I say, not the most interesting one. Uh. Next we got a beach buggy and uh, this transformation is nice and easy. We pull back on this, the wings come out, this unfolds and it flies around just like that. See I told you most of these are just flying stuff. Uh, but this is a pretty cool one, I do like this one. And slides into that, there we go. And back to being a buggy again. I also have a uh, drag racing car. Uh, this is a pretty boring one as well, because you did get it like that. 
and it goes up like that which you can't see because it's gone too high back at the front net it's the missile and that does work hooray something that works place that down and yeah um i there's supposed to be sank on the back but i have no idea where that went to next up atv so uh, this is most probably not one of my favorites either uh you pull down as you can see i'll just show you quickly pull down the back and it just closes like that little saw comes out but if you flip this over it guns at the front there on a chainsaw so you can roll along and slice up all the enemies it needs to the toys back in the 80s and 90s were so much better than today they actually wanted to try and destroy their enemies this one i have no idea whatsoever i can't remember where it came from but all it does is that uh, I'm sure there's sunk house to it. I guess it went underwater, maybe. Yeah, I have absolutely no idea on this one. So next, we'll look at another motorbike, which is supposed to be going up like that. This is another flying one, which is missing the other side. Well, it's not missing the other side. I do have it, but. Of course it's snapped off and all this does is well that's supposed to be down like that anyway then it flips up that comes down and they fly with a gun on the front which is also the steering wheel or the handlebars which doesn't make any sense because you can't drive and shoot at the same time so yeah that's uh, slightly broken another motorbike which is one of my favorite motorbikes uh, it's a bit more cooler it turns into a helicopter so the back here flips up we're gonna do these and then we take this back wheel bring it out and it's now a helicopter yeah so <laughs> I ain't wrong I, um, I am not wrong when it when I say it comes to uh, to flying with most of these vehicles. Click on that and back to the motorbike again. Hmm. Next is one of the cooler ones if it manages to stay in. Which is this buggy thing. And the buggy, if we pull on this, oh now you're not gonna that's supposed to shoot out, so we'll put that back in again. Right, stay in there. Right, pull it back. Ah, there we are, and it fires out and becomes a little boat. Um, I think there was supposed to be a weapon on back. I know there's supposed to be a barrel on there which flips off, but I have no idea where any of that has gone. Oh, now I'm gonna have trouble getting it back in there. Oh, there we are, just stay there. Don't do anything stupid. All right. Another vehicle, which is, I believe, supposed to go into water, but it's missing a door. It's this one. So when the transformation happens, the doors open up like that. Click on... No, what was that button for? I forget. Anyway, right. So we click on the back here. And all the uh, water engines come up. There's a button on the side just here. Which flips that over. We turn the wheels over. And there you are, there's your James Bond underwater car. Of course, if you know, you've got these little things in the tyre, they're supposed to come up and be guns or something. I'm never quite sure on that point. Uh, we've got a couple of guns at the front there. Nice little car, one of my favourites. Hmm. Let me get the wheels straight. There we go. Ugh. Right then, another little buggy type car. I bet you can't believe what this transforms into. That's right, another helicopter thing. So, these flip up. This goes up like that. Clicks into place, and uh, there you are. Get yourself a helicopter. 
can't remember what these things on the side do. I can't remember if they're missiles or not. Uh, got some bullets, guns under here, which fold in. Uh, can't remember if that's supposed to come off or not. Oh well. Uh, yeah. Plain little vehicle. Ooh. Next up is the racing car. Because uh, Speed do like racing. Uh, Matt Trekker, as it says on the side there, he was the leader of Mask. That's the only person's name I can remember because it's written down. And uh, for this one, this turns into, can you guess it? Yes, another flying vehicle. So click that, and wheels go underneath. And there you are, you got yourself an aeroplane. Uh, <laughs> yeah. They do like their racing and their flying. Take that down. Back to an F1 car. A pretty cool little car, I do like that one. One of my favourites. Alright, now we bring out the baddies vehicle. Uh, the head of Fenham. Of course this is an aeroplane mode. But can you guess what it originally was? That's right, it was another flying vehicle. So we flip that back. Now the wings are supposed to fold in. Uh, that one does. I don't think. No, the other side doesn't flip in. These go down. They go in. There's no more gun set. This pops up and the propeller comes off the top. Oh, I'll sort that out later. And yeah, it turns into a helicopter and you can press the button on the side here. I can't really see that. It'll fly around. This side doesn't work anymore. Well, there you are. <laughs> I'll put that to one side for the moment and I'll uh, figure it out in a second. And next up, we got this car with the spoilers. And then this car, all this does is, if it doesn't solve, just flips up with two guns outside the front. And it's supposed to have some discs in here, which uh, shoot off. Uh, can't actually see it. Oh, can't get the camera. Let's dip the camera up a bit. There we go. Look at that. All its glory. Nice, simple transformation. Nothing too wrong with it. A bit boring, if you tell, ask me, but... There's only so much you can do with these types of toys. But... Oh, damn you. Damn you and your springs. Next, we've got a little, like, camper fan thing. So we press the button, which is at the back here. Flips out to show you you've got a little aeroplane inside. Yes, another flight one. So there's another button. Flips that up. Guns come out of the front. And then this comes off. As you can see, there's a little character inside. If I open that up, there we go, there's, nope, you're not going to focus. Well, there's a little guy inside there, he goes onto there, let's put the gun back over. Place it down, close that up, and there we are. Mm. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Next up, we have this other aeroplane here. Uh, so this aeroplane, I cannot get this front piece off, no matter what I try, and I don't really want to break it. Ugh, I'm trying to warm my mic. You press this little button here. The wheels come up behind, so it's like a cannon on the back, and then this is supposed to come off, so it can fly around on its own, but I can't get the front off, and I don't really want to break it that much. So, uh, Place that back down, put the wings back up. No, nope, the wings are wings are dead as well. Uh, yeah. Little flying thing. Little flying thing. And of course no leader would be without his own signature car. So this is Matt Tracer's car. It's uh if you ever watch a TV series, of course this is the staple car. The guns are falling off the side, the gun has fallen off this side. 
Uh, but you press the button up here, the top comes up at the back, shut off the jet, and the wings are supposed to be the doors. Of course they don't stay up. These come out to be guns, and then you can fly around and shoot all the baddies he wants. There we are, the classic mask car. Of course, it wouldn't be masked without. Oh, the little figures that come with it, including the robot. He was actually missing an arm. I don't know where the arm is. But he transforms into a motorbike for Matt's kid and he can ride along. I did have Matt's kid, but I don't know where he's gone. But here's some of the figures. Of course, you're not going to focus, are you? Come on. There we go. Look at that. And of course, the main man. Where is he? This is Matt Tracker. Pull off this helmet. There we are. Look at him. All in his beauty. And then I got a few weird coloured ones as well. Like the red one there. This yellow guy here. Is that not? A few other little bits and pieces. So. Put the down into there. And uh, that's pretty much it for my collection. Apart from one thing. Now, no team would be without its main base. So, I have the original Boulder Hill. Now, take my phone off. So there we are, we can look around. We got the pumps at the front, got the sign, and then of course the boulder. Also a Boulder Hill gas here as well. So, this also transformed, because this was one of the coolest toys ever. These guns here, uh, let me, there's a lever at the back and you can twist it and it will uh, turn the guns for you. But I haven't got a good enough setup to show you that one. Uh, the shop front is next. So, we press the gun at the back here. It flips down and of course it falls off because Mine no work. Right, that's supposed to. Right. Oh god, this is back. Give me a second. Stupid thing. Ah. Oh, right, so. Yeah. The front comes down like this. That's supposed to be underneath. It does work. This is the first time it hasn't. So that's very disappointing. Next we'll look at the uh, boulder gas hill and if we turn the sign around, reveal some guns to shoot. And then of course we have the garage here. We pull at the back here. No, oh, that's the wrong lever. It opens up to become an armoured garage, which is pretty cool. And all the cars can uh, go inside there. Pretty neat. And then last but not least is the boulder itself. So if we give it a quick twist to the back here, it pops up to reveal a gun hidden inside. And the boulder falls down, so. Yeah. That is my uh, mask collection. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm sorry it's filmed on the phone. I uh, uh, couldn't really do it any other way at the moment. Uh, but I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.